Unfortunately, so many of you are accustomed to interacting with and dealing with people that do not keep their word and aren't serious about the things that they say. I would hope that after time, you'll be able to see that I am not one of those individuals. After completing my amazing new track, UK to Ghana, it's time for me to return back to my home in Accra, Ghana. So today we'll be traveling from London to Lisbon to Accra, Ghana. And to be honest, I cannot wait. I've been out of Ghana for about three weeks now, and it's definitely time for me to get back home to my family, friends, the sun, and all. <laughs> On this particular trip, I had so many things to think about. I had the experience of working in the nursing home and seeing people in the last stages of their life. And it's had a profound impact on my mentality. Those of us that are trailblazing often ask ourselves, are we making the right decisions? Sometimes we think perhaps I should go back to my life the way it used to be. But after the experience that I had recently in the UK, I'm completely resolute that I'm doing the right thing by being ambitious and being aggressive about achieving my future goals. Being able to get through all the hardships that I did on this last trip, including homelessness, joblessness, hateration from some of you guys, and so much more, let me know that, hey, <laughs> you know, there are a lot of bumps and obstacles in the road, but you gotta stay focused, you gotta stay black and true. You gotta get your goals accomplished, you know? So heading back to Ghana, I feel so gratified and I also feel so relieved. I was on the subway trains falling asleep. I was falling asleep in the airport. I was just so relaxed because um, I no longer had to deal with the everyday pressures and the stuff that I was going through. And to all of you guys that thought, oh my gosh, Gina's gonna have to stay in the UK. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I told y'all I came to record music and that was the first and foremost primary goal. So now that I have done it, I'm free and clear to go back home. And just like that, I'm back in East Lake Gone. You guys see this beautiful house behind me? It's not my house, it's not my house. No, but this is, you know, the sights and sounds of East Lake Gone. I'm here with my sister, camera girl. Hi, money. <laughs> so we're on our way to. Um, she said we're going to go to D Cafe or the Good Baker. I'm not sure. I'm just out here. Um, the ANC Shopping Center is walking distance from our house, so. We both come here quite often, um, go for eating. I was going to the gym at ANC, um, you know, take care of business, like go to Vodafone, this kind of thing. Yes, so just like that, I'm back in East Lake Gone. I spent the whole day yesterday traveling in, and once I got in, I settled in everything like that. Spent some time with my sister, um, started trying to unpack these bags and just, you know, taking it in. I haven't been warm for three good weeks and it felt so nice to land at the airport and feel the heat. Now we are in rainy season. You guys can see it's not very sunny. Um, we did also have rain last night when, when I got in. Um, so the temperature has been about 24 degrees Celsius, which the normal here is around 30, 32. So it's a bit cooler here. So definitely the people that live here in Ghana, you know, feel like it's a cooler or colder season. But for me, coming from real cold, <laughs> it felt warm and, and everything. So it was really nice. Yeah, so we back in the building and we're just gonna take care of a few things today. Like I just told you guys, I'm gonna head to the nail shop and fix this broken nail. Can you imagine? Paid 35 pounds and it didn't even last a week. Absolutely ridiculous. So chill with us on our day. Back in East Lake On. Okay guys, so something you probably don't know about my sister is she's a coffee breakfast junkie. 
And so she, there are several cafes she frequents. There she is. So we're at the Good Baker, which is in East Lake On. They have a really nice selection of bread. I'm told they actually have bagels and cream cheese. And my sister gets coffee. Good morning. Yes. They also have um, desserts. So they have cakes and all kind of sweets, tarts, the whole nine. And then if you just want like a little package sandwich, these are so common in the UK. So this kind of stuff here. So yeah, I'm gonna actually get a bagel. There's the drink list. As you see, prices are changing. They don't have anything listed. <laughs> Okay guys, after getting my nails done, check out the new design, huh? What? <laughs> this is like my tribute to the Dominican flag, except it's pink and black, not red and blue. Um, we're back at a familiar spot, the pan and cook, pancakes and more with my sister, our peach tea, our pan, pan and cook. So this has been our day. We spent a lot of time in the nail shop. I got my hands and feet done, huh? What? What, huh? It is absolutely necessary. Those of you running around with them Flintstone feet. <laughs> my sister laughing at you. <laughs> yeah, Flintstone feet, it's not a good look, especially if you wear sandals. Ladies, do your do your P's and Q's, you know, be on top of your game. Um, so yeah, we ain't got the hands and feet done. And now we're having a snack and then, you know, we're gonna go home, so. This is my first full day back in East Lake Gone. It feels good to be back home. It feels good. Um, weather been a little overcast today, but that's okay. Yeah, it didn't rain. Yeah, it didn't rain. Yeah. It might later. Yeah. Right. <laughs> it's, it rained all last evening. It rained all last evening. And um, that's okay. So we're going to get on these, these um, little mini pancakes, see what they look like. Yeah, I know y'all want to eat some. Huh? What? Peach tea? Yeah. Mmm. <laughs> yeah my sister be on this pan and cook all the time now i brought her here and now it's the path of no return so she be she be here all the time so yeah guys we're going to enjoy our snack much love to the african superstar family make sure you like share and subscribe to this video until we meet again stay black and true if you ain't black just stay true